Hello, Blackwell Brides, and congratulations. Thank you. Our, fi our fifth Kerrang Award. Five Ks. Five Ks. So, as you just said, you called it earlier this evening. I called it. Well, I, I didn't call it. I I guess in some ways I I, uh, I said it would be nice. Thinking. Yeah, wishful thinking, I guess. Can you come to the racetrack with me sometime? Of course you Sure, there. yeah. Uh, I've never been, but I imagine I'd probably do well. If it's anything like guessing Kerrang Awards, I guess, you know, I could probably do that. Based on the horse thing. Yeah. So, how do you feel to... Uh, obviously, this being your fifth award is kind of... You've got over the... Correct. Sure. We've got an award thing. How does it feel to win you know, best live band? It because feels great. I love holding it. I told Jinx if we win a six one, he'll get to hold it. Uh, so you know, next. That's cool, dude. Because we always talk about showmanship and live performance. How you know rock and roll's been boring in so long. You know, and you know how it is stale and stagnant. So I'm glad that you know this is a testament to what we do on stage. So. Sure. Honestly, really, really I mean, cool. I think I think that when when it, you look at a live band category, um, there's different reasons why someone comes to a show. Some people don't prefer the theatrics and everything. When people come to one of our shows, we have things blowing up and explosions and video screens and everything else. We like to put on a theatrical show, and I think that this is a nice little award for uh, our efforts to put on that theatrical show. But it doesn't mean that any of the other bands are less than or whatever else. Just the fans voted, and we're very happy to get it. Modesty. So, uh, you know, with, you know, like Judas Priest, Alice Cooper, Marilyn Manson in the room, how did that feel to win like, an award for being a live band? Well, we're, but we're children guys. of their thinking. You know, we are, if it wasn't for those bands, we wouldn't exist. And we wear that very openly and honestly. Um, we wear our influences on our sleeves. We're proudly a product of the past and what we came from. And we think that if rock and roll is going to evolve and continue on, you have to play into the things that worked before because that's really the only way. We believe in true rock and roll and the idea that you can put on a show and believe in what you do. And you don't have to have 36 people on the stage with banjos and looking at their feet and uh, feeling as sad as they possibly can about their show. We like fun. Okay. 36 people on stage would be good though. I don't know. I mean, go to a Mumford and Sons show. There's like 40 of them. <laughs> and finally, you've got five Ks now, so have you all got one each? Uh, well, we've, I, we've talked about this before. One of them is a Hottest Male Award, so they don't have that one. They, we felt like it would be weird for their mantles. The Andy Hottest Male Award. In the same way, I don't have their Guitar Player Award. You know, we celebrate. You we have swap them all, man. As a band, I believe we have uh, four Ks. Yeah. So this is our fourth yeah, K fourth as a band. Cool. Well, Blackwell Bryce, congratulations again. Thank you very much. Thank you so Thank much, you. man. Appreciate it.